Are we still living behind the screen? I mean, don't get me wrong, my camera's not off, so you know I'm still here and I can't fake bad connection, so I can't. And God knows my pants are still on, even though I wish they weren't. Well, not like that. But then again, I still ask you, are we still living behind the screen? Because your camera's not off, but sometimes I don't really know if you're even there, or if you're roasting coffee and brewing tea on the side, or if you're trying to catch up on that last hour of sleep while your eyes are still open to get that full aid in, or if you're listening to the Spotify in your head because Olivia Rodrigo's driver's license needs to be played for the 435th time this year, are you really here? Because on that screen, this wave looks real, no matter what. And you think the person on the other end of the screen likes you, but that smile is just what happens when they see themselves in the top right corner of the screen. <laughs> and after that happens for our 5 to 30 minute conversation, we log off, act as if that never really happened, and we go back to our normal lives. And everything that's on that screen stays there. Um, where the, the four corners of the screen, of the frame, are everything that exists in our lives. Because everything you want them to see is there. I mean, they see the button up top, you see the five other outfit options half hung in your closet. They see the aesthetic posters on the wall, you see the mess on your floor you didn't have the energy to clean. They see your head bent vigilantly towards your desk. You see the journal of discombobulated thoughts. The writing on your essay, the rejection letter from the college of your dreams, the love note you never sent. And the fact that you're now mute isn't a concern, it's just a courtesy. And the smile that they see on camera masks the five other times a day that you cry. And they think you're still there on the other end of that screen, but they don't see the million times you tried to walk away. You just stay there, we just stay here. Our relationship is only as strong as our connection. Because on our screens, we actually care about their reception. Because our connection is the only way that we'd be able to talk to each other. Otherwise, we always hear our bits and pieces and snippets of the stories that we're trying to tell so we'd get closer to the route, to the model, to whatever let us see the other person better. To the TikTok references that I don't really understand, but I don't need to understand where the TikTok references are from to know that they are hilarious. To the late night jam sessions in our dorm where you're on the guitar, I'm on vocals, we're on the same note but in perfect harmony. To the how was your day where I hear about the million and first way that chemistry has knocked you down, and I'm ready to tell you the million and second way that you're going to get back up. To the late night chats where I no longer know the person behind the screen. But I know the person themselves, and, and they are wonderful and talented and special, and they are going to make a difference in this world. And I can't wait to see it happen.